stealing your hard-earned money. Visit noblegoldinvestments.com or call us at 877-646-5347. <laughs> Checking KF Five traffic, we do have a crash in East LA on the 60 East on Atlantic Boulevard. That one has all eight blocks have to be taken off at Atlantic Boulevard. New Paris on the 250 northbound at D Street, a crash there blocking the off ramp. And we have some road work in Ontario, 10 westbound from the I-15, the Haven, the three right lane, coming up until 5 a.m. Monday. KF Five in the sky helps get you there faster. I'm Jonathan White. Hitler, is he in heaven? And then is some young girl 
uh, just because this was a, a topic a moment ago, so many girls that had an abortion, is she in hell? Or these types of things. Right. And the reality is, no one can know. No one can know. Conceivably, uh, conceivably anybody who repents. Yes. But because could a murderer and his victims be in heaven together? Absolutely. Isn't that kind of strange, or does God work things out for them? Well, no. <laughs> yeah, it's a counseling. It's a little crass to think about, but you think about it in human. You're thinking about it, murder being the worst thing ever. But to God, the worst thing ever so is the gift of God. So, so I in that concept, I, I think it's different. Here's my no. thought with the third option. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a Catholic who gave it up early on. My third option is, if you don't do anything bad on earth, you don't get to spend eternity with God. Okay, you reject it. I can take that. But there should be something, a third option called non-existence. Uh, uh, this is called annihilation, and it's not an option. As a matter of fact, Scripture says, uses the, the, the same word, anios, for um, eternity, for heaven, as it does for hell in Matthew. There's not really, unfortunately, any way around that. There isn't an option of annihilation. You are listening to the Jesus Christ Show. To ask your question, dial 800 520 mm. Smart speakers, we're in a couple of smart ears as well. KSI. KOST AC2. Los Angeles, Orange County. Live everywhere on the Anchor Radio app. Inside a busy bar, I'm Layla Muhammad live from the KFI 24 hour newsroom. 15 people have been shot at a bar in St. Paul, Minnesota. One of them has died. Police say the shooting happened around 12 15 this morning. When they arrived, they found victims inside the bar and outside on the sidewalk. Investigators say at this point they believe there were multiple shooters. U.S. Coast Guard officials say a ship's anchor is still the prime cause in the oil spill off the coast of Orange County, but the spill may have happened up to a year ago. Captain Jason Neubauer says the damaged pipe was encased in concrete, which is now gone, and there is marine growth on the pipe itself. That has refocused the frame and time frame of our investigation to at least several months to a year ago. GPS data and company records show in October of last year, the pipeline was still in place and undamaged. Investigators have ruled out fishing vessels because they say the force required to drag the pipe more than 100 feet could not be generated by small boats. The investigation will focus on all vessel traffic over the pipeline in the last year. That includes a heavy weather event last January. L.A. County is reporting more than 1,200 new cases of COVID-19, and 30 more people have died. There are 721 people in the hospital. Officials say cases among healthcare workers continue to decline with the new vaccination requirement in effect. Coronavirus infections for healthcare workers are down 60% since an increase in August. Doctors are concerned about a bad flu season mixed with the COVID-19 pandemic. White House COVID Advisory Board member Dr. Julie Morita says vaccines are important. If people are getting their first doses of the COVID vaccine, they can also get flu vaccine. If they're getting booster doses, they can also get flu vaccine. She says the flu season has been mild the last two years because of mask mandates and people staying home more because of the pandemic. About 2,000 people are running in the 37th annual Long Beach Marathon. The 26-mile marathon course will start in about an hour on Shoreline Drive. Runners will then pass through the pipe at Rainbow Harbor Retail and Entertainment Center, run on an on-ramp to the 710 Freeway, cross the Queensway Bridge to the Bow of the Queen Mary, uh, and the fill will loop around the lighthouse at Rainbow Harbor, head to Pier Point Landing. Then back to the start finish area i'm exhausted for them good luck with that Whew. hundreds of flights are reportedly getting canceled or delayed because of air traffic control issues and bad weather southwest, air, southwest airlines says airports across the country are experiencing the same issue yesterday including the sacramento international airport southwest did not say how many flights are affected but flight aware said more than 700 flights were canceled and 850 were delayed across the country Road. Okay. Well, while the computer decides to reboot. For teachers, oh, anyway. Let's try this again. Teacher, sorry, Amy. Let's take this again. Oh, it feels like a Monday. 
oh, it's not working again. There's something wrong. Okay, let's go to traffic. Uh, Tony, take it away. Well, it looks like we have a crash in the East LA area on the 16th side of Atlantic Boulevard. This one has all lanes blocked. Traffic is being taken off of Atlantic Boulevard. We want to carry out the 10 west south from the I-15 to Haven. We have some road work to three white lanes coming off until 5 a.m. And look out in Pico Rivera on the 605 North on of Beverly Boulevard. The crash there blocking the right lane. Okay, if I miss that, help get you there faster. I'm Jonathan White. Oh, uh, thanks, Jonathan. And thank you, Tony, for covering. Uh, he's on board up. Uh, we have some nice weather ahead. I'll have those details next. Someone uses your toilet and it overflows. Can you imagine how embarrassing that is for your guests and for you? Hello, I'm John McCoyan, owner of Rooter Hero Plumbing. You're hosting a party, the water is on the floor, and your guests have to tell you that the toilet is backed up. And worst of all, you have to tell your guests that they can't use the bathroom. I shudder when I tell this story because it happened to me. Can you imagine? I own Rooter Hero Plumbing and my toilet overflows. Talk about being humbled. Well, the truth is, it could happen to anyone. And the solution is to call 866-DRAIN-77. That's what I did, and our plumber was here within the hour. Not because I'm the owner, but that's just what we do. I'm so confident that you'll be satisfied with our services that I put my cell phone number on every business card. 866-DRAIN-77. That's 866-DRAIN-77. <laughs> If you thought you missed a Lowe's mortgage rates in history, you're in luck because they're back. Mortgage rates are new historic lows again. So if you have a mortgage, refinance it and forget it. You'll never have to worry about refinancing again. Network Capital Funding is offering a low 16-year fixed rate at 1.75% with a 1.94 APR. Incredible! Network Capital has built a reputation for saving people time and money with our unique process that's fast, simple, and secure. Our 15-year fixed rate is 1.75% with a 1.94 APR. Now, there's a chance this won't come often and you may never see these rates again. So, refinance it and forget it. That's a 15-year fix at 1.75%. Yes, 1.75% with a 1.94 APR. Call the experts at Network Capital now. Call 800-500-NUMBER-1-HIT. 800-501-HIT. As in home run, call now and save big on your refi. 800-500-1-HIT. 800-500-1448. Now, when the news channels start using terms like quantitative easing and now tapering a lot, you know there's trouble ahead. What does it mean? Well, despite everything you hear, it just means less money in your pocket. Fewer dollars to spend. Everything costs more. Food, gas, utilities, all going up. Does anything cost less than last year? It's bad enough if you're young, but if you're close to retirement, it could be a disaster for your savings. A gold or silver IRA or 401k with Noble Gold will solve this inflation problem for good. And they're giving away a free 5-ounce solid silver America the Beautiful bullion coin with each qualifying plan you start this month as a thank you. Not bad, huh? The best part? You'll speak to an expert. No hassle, no pressure, just a look at your options and what you can do to stop the Fed stealing your hard-earned money. Visit NobleGoldInvestments.com or call us at 877-646-5347. Okay, I have control again. I have control again. Southland land weather for KFI. Mostly sunny highs in the low 70s at the beaches. Upper 70s for the LA Basin and Inland OC. Low 80s in the valley and IE near 80 in the high desert. Low 60s in the mountains. Here's the deal. That breezy weather is moving back into the forecast tomorrow. Highs will be in the 70s for much of the week. Right now, it's 54 degrees in Yorba Linda. 58 in San Clemente. 55 in Venice Beach. 50 in Reseda. We lead local. Live from the KFI, 24 hour newsroom, I'm Layla Muhammad. Over 2,000 years ago, I walked this earth. Teaching, healing, inspiring. And preparing to make the ultimate sacrifice. For God so loved the world 
that it is its only begotten Son. That whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. What if today you and I could talk voice to voice and you could ask me these things? You are listening to the Jesus Christ Show. Right? 
and afterwards he says, see you are well again, and uh, stop sinning or something worse may happen to you in this description. So, you're looking at that, uh, obviously in the red, I'm saying there, I'm being clear that I knew what caused the man's condition. Those specifics aren't given to anybody reading about the physical impairment, but the context implies that it was caused by a sinful choice. So basically, in that context, it's like, okay, you've got a do-over. Make better choices, or you're going to be back in the same situation again. Now, when you go on and you find uh, in other verses, uh, uh, for instance, John 8, 3 through 11, when you're dealing with uh, the woman taken in the act of adultery, and you've got the women, the woman's accusers, you know, kind of bringing her before me, saying, hey, go ahead and judge her. As a matter of fact, this is kind of a setup in the day, because you had uh, so-called holy people or religious folks trying to put me in a situation that they thought would put me up against the wall. That's the whole purpose of many of these things, is to, uh, the Pharisees to try to make me look bad. So, in this uh, case, the words are, um, okay, if you're going to stone her, go ahead and stone her, but I just ask that the person without sin stoned her. And one by one they left. Because they all had sin. Now, when they leave, my response is, you know, they don't condemn you, and neither do I condemn you. Go and sin no more. That's usually the verse where people hear that and they go, okay, what's that? Well, she had been caught. She was guilty. Uh, so was the guy and that they never brought. But the, the truth of that verse is that she was caught. So it wasn't about going and sin no more ever. Like you're, you're now I, I'm saying you can go off and you won't ever sin again. As a matter of fact, what's being said there is you were caught in an act of sin. Go, I don't condemn you on this one. Go and don't do it anymore. That's sin. Now, it doesn't mean you're going to do without sin that's impossible on earth, except for me. So everyone else will be in the state of sinlessness or perfection in heaven. And only them. So it's not about saying, okay, you, you have to set your a new standard and never sinning. That is your standard, that has it, and you won't live up to it. Nobody does. If there was an, a way to not sin anymore on earth, then it would have been silly for me to die on the It wouldn't make sense. And that is the only oh, way to do it. So if it's just, hey, go and sin no more, and somebody would not sin, there would have been no need to die on the So these were specific situations that had specific sins attached to them that I was saying, don't do that thing anymore. That thing that brought you to my foot right now. Don't do that to me. It's the equivalent of, uh, you know, a judge. It's interesting. I think.